Hello, my name is Mike Boyle. I'm a consultant neonatologist uh, in the Rotunda Hospital and also a fellow of the Royal College of Physicians. And we're here in Graves Hall on number six, Kildare Street in the Royal College of Physicians home. And I'm beside Sir Henry Marsh, who is one of the four statues in this room that were commissioned from the Irish sculptor John Henry Foley. And people may not necessarily recognise the name straight off, but you might be familiar with his most famous work from an Irish perspective, and that would be the O'Connell Monument on O'Connell Street. Um, Henry Marsh uh, started out his life as a surgical trainee, um, but when he was in the dissection room, managed to cut his index finger on the right hand, and it became septic and needed to be amputated. And after that, he retrained as a physician. And the reason I suppose that he's of interest to me is that he was responsible with a former master of the Redundant Hospital in setting up the first children's hospital in uh, Ireland or Great Britain. And that was just around the corner on Molesworth Street originally, and that became the precursor to the National Children's Hospital on Harcourt Street. And one of their earliest trainees actually went on to be uh, the founder of Great Ormond Street Children's Hospital in London. Uh, Henry Marsh's statue was the first one that was commissioned, and as you can see, his right and his finger has been restored, and he was the president of the college on three different 